Good morning, everybody. Um, now that I've got this iPad um, that that Rocket Tube uh, gave me, but well, I didn't. I, I I won it. I won it from Rocket, so they didn't just like you know walk up and go here. Um, but uh, if if you um, haven't been to Rocket Tube, go to go to Rocket Tube because I I love Rocket Tube because they they had a contest where I could win an iPad and I did. Damn it. Dear Jason, I know you're probably not a fan of Glee. Um, probably a, a good assumption. Um, here's here's the thing. Um, I I have a tel I have two televisions, um, but I don't have cable because um, I don't watch television. I use my TV to watch like movies and um, you know I sort of use it as a sort of entertainment center, so I play music on it. Um, there are a few television shows and, and things that I, I do actually watch. I watch Doctor Who, I watch uh, Torchwood. Um, there's a couple of American shows that I watch, too. Um, one was called Off the Map, and apparently they just canceled it, and I was all kind of pissed about that. Um, uh, Hawaii Five-0. I like Hawaii Five-0, mostly because I kind of want to have sex with Scott Kahn. Um, and, and I'm not ashamed to admit that. You know, um, so Scott, you've got you've got my number. It's on the restraining order. Just give me a shout anytime. You know, we can we can go wax each other's boards. Ah, sorry, tangent. Um, I know you're probably not a fan of Glee, but I wanted to ask you this anyway. There was recently an episode called "Born This Way," where the kids and the teachers all wore T-shirts with a word or phrase on it that described the one thing about them that everyone can see but nobody wants to talk about. Mine would say shy. What would yours say? Okay, so, um, just to get a little bit of context for it, I actually, uh, I actually bought the episode, uh, Born This Way, from, uh, from iTunes, and, uh, I, I inflicted it not only on myself, but my husband. Um, and we watched it, and, uh, first of all, I mean, it was kind of fun. So um, I actually wound up um, going back one episode and then forward two. So I watched four episodes of Glee, um, kind of all all in a row. Um, so I could I could kind of have some context for the whole thing. Um, it's still a little weird to me that they all suddenly burst into song out of nowhere. Um, and apparently Gwyneth fucking Paltrow was was on like an episode, and that just can't happen. So I I probably won't be watching any more of that because. Um, the, the name Gwyneth Paltrow um, kind of makes me want to shit my pants. Um, but, you know, that's just me. But my t-shirt, um, I would, after watching the episode, I was, I was sitting there the whole time going, fuck, what would my t-shirt say? Um, and uh, I would probably have to have, like, a whole closet full of them. Um, I would have one, obviously, that said short. Um, cause I'm always going on about how short I am. Um, I would probably have one that says shut up, uh, cause I talk too much. Um, I would have one that says ADHD, um, cause I've got really severe out of control, uh, ADHD and it, um, oh, what the fuck, you know what, let's talk about it. Um. When I was in school, you know, uh, back when I was a kid, ADHD was not something that we knew about. Um, kids with ADHD, um, we were called hyperactive, and we were pretty much written off as uh, out-of-control, unruly brats who wouldn't sit still. And uh, I was told by many teachers that I was one of the smartest students in the class, but I just wouldn't apply myself, and I was a first-class slacker, and like all of those, you know, things that they, um, that they say, and I remember, you know, I sort of managed to be in, you know, sort of towards the top of my class, all the way through high school, even though, you know, and, and if you don't have ADHD, it's difficult to explain, just try to picture if you're trying to read a book, um, in a room with a whole bunch of people shouting and screaming. And that's kind of what everyday life is like for people with ADHD that is, is untreated. And uh, it's, 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 a bit, um, it's a bit difficult, you know. And I somehow managed to make it through not only high school, 
Um, but uh, college twice, um, you know, some somehow before uh, before I was actually diagnosed with it. So, um, you know what? What the hell? I can't wear a t-shirt, but I will proudly come out as somebody who has ADHD. So there you go. That's probably what my t-shirt would say. It also might say bald. So, uh, you know, uh, metalhead, um, biker, um, doesn't wear deodorant. You know, could say all of these things. Oh, and a bonus question. Which Fleetwood Mac song would you sing? There's an episode afterward called Rumors. Um, I would probably not uh, sing a song from, uh, from Rumors if I could just choose any Fleetwood Mac song. Um, my favorite Fleetwood Mac song is Big Love. Um... So, I, I would probably sing that. Keep asking me questions.